So my friends ask me all the time, how many fruit trees do you have? And I'm like, 13. They're like, where do you live, on a farm? I'm like, nope, just in my backyard. But the key is that I'm following David Wilson's backyard orchard culture, and I keep my trees a manageable size. I have friends of mine that have huge trees in their backyard, and I go by and I'm like, dude, you're never gonna be able to eat all that fruit. This is a small uh, pluot tree. It's not even three years old. Let's zoom in on it. Look how much fruit is on this tree. Okay, there's gotta be at least 50, 60 pieces of fruit on this tree. <laughs> Why would I want a tree, this one right here is about six feet tall. Why would I want a tree that's 12 feet tall? Who's gonna climb on the ladder to pick it? Who's gonna eat all that fruit? You become that person um, I'm sure everyone has it, that one neighbor who walks down the street with those shopping bags full of fruit, can't give them away. The minute you see him, you go inside your house, you close the garage door, you close the front door, pull down the shades. Don't be that person. Just maintain a normal sized fruit tree. And then you can have as much fruit as you want. Like I said, I have pluots, I have plums, I have peaches, I have pears, I have apples, I have oranges, I have, uh, what else? We have figs, um, grapefruit, all because I keep all of them to a manageable size. Imagine size.